Welcome to our Tartessa News for the week of January 5th, 2015. I'm Angie. And I'm Steph. Welcome to your new year. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And the NFL teams are in the playoff battle, fighting for the chance to play in the Super Bowl. Next month, here in Glendale, Arizona. If the Cardinals play well, they could be the first team to ever play in the Super Bowl at their home stadium. Two weeks ago, our soccer field was open officially, and the girls' basketball games will be starting soon. Thanks for watching your sports update. See you next time. Thanks, Cassandra. Now over to Stephanie with our joke of the week. Which building has the most stories? Why? A library. <laughs> Thanks, Stephanie. Now over to Ms. Britton with a special message. Good morning, Tartesso students and staff. Welcome to a 2015 school year. I hope you had a wonderful holiday. I hope everybody was safe and you had time to spend with your families. We opened the new turf soccer field and got to see what all of the after school clubs were doing last Friday. I hope you were there to celebrate with us. Have a wonderful week and remember citizenship and please listen to your teachers and try your best in class. Thanks, Ms. Burton. Now here's Jesus with the weird news. Have you ever heard of the turtle who got sick for eating a turtle? This week on Weird News, we will talk about the turtle eating turtle. A vet in Miami called for an immediate x-ray for a small turtle and made the discovery that it had eaten a small turtle pendant. See you next week on Weird News. Thanks, Jesus. Now, here's Noel with What's Trending. This week's find is from a guy named Gabe. The title is When Your Best Friend Replaces You. Thanks, Noah. Here's Nicholas with our fun fact trivia. What kind of fun fact trivia with Nicholas? You got three answers, guess which one's wrong. A, when you talk to someone you like, your voice changes. B, research says when you take part to respond to text, you're telling the truth. C, after Pearl Harbor, Canada claimed war first on Japan before the United States. You got 10 seconds, guess which one's wrong. is B, when you take forever to text somebody, most likely, you're telling a lie. Nicholas, we're coming right back to you with a new segment called Funny History. Welcome to a new segment called Funny History, and I'm your host, Nicholas. If you ever felt stupid, just remember that the Roman Emperor Caligula sent a Rome army to go and attack the sea with catapults and fought waves. Pretty dumb, right? We here at TNN would like to wish these students a happy birthday this week. A heroic school bus driver in Akron, Ohio, sacrificed her life to save a 10-year-old girl late last year by throwing her out of the way of a rolling bus. Sadly, the driver was unable to save herself and was killed. Akron Police Officer Rick Edwards confirmed that the driver sacrificed her own life to save the life of a 10-year-old girl. According to the Associated Press, Edwards said the bus pulled up beside Middlebury Academy in Akron when the driver asked the students to perform a routine evacuation drill. The students, about 40 ranging from the kindergartners to 8th graders, first exited the bus at the front and lined up single file on the sidewalk as instructed. They then got back on the bus and exited the rear emergency exit. Edwards said the 10-year-old girl, the last one to exit, was climbing out the back of the bus when the vehicle started rolling backwards. 
Edward said the driver threw the girl into the lawn and then the bus rolled over the driver. I don't think she had time to react, Edward said. Have a great start to 2015 and we'll see you next week. Now let's go over to Jesus with our final thought. This week's final thought comes from the greatest NBA player to have ever played, Michael Jordan. I can accept failure. Everyone fails at something, but I can't accept not trying.